mathematics well, i don't know if engineering does engineering count sorry does engineering count no i'm asking uh, pure maths pure maths yeah i have a degree who's that spatma oh okay excellent okay now this maths is something that everyone has done basic only at school level and i'll show these like this numbers if you can identify what these numbers are named in math integers that wouldn't be mathematically correct really okay <laughs> okay <laughs> that wouldn't be accurate yeah natural numbers padma natural numbers yes so these are like the counting numbers and these do not have zero okay second one hmm, includes negative numbers these are what mr vasudev said earlier integers mm -hmm. next what are what are these fractions yeah fractions but there's a broader name for that they are called rational numbers yes. yeah now fourth one square root of 2 does anyone remember in the school what this is 1.2 irrational irrational yes they are not rational they are irrational that means if you express it as uh, in decimal format this will be an uh, non terminating decimal number next is a square root of a negative number imaginary yes imaginary numbers then we have a combination of real and imaginary what are these complex yes complex numbers can you guess what could be the seventh one seventh is uh, transcendental numbers these are like non algebraic numbers okay now coming to what uh, they mean or what meaning i have given uh, so this one i consider it as indivisible that means they will remain as it is if it's not, if it's a decimal or anything else you do it's going to be not a natural number anymore so if the natural number is indivisible equating it to bold fighter okay second one having negative also so here is about thinking negative okay then rational numbers is always having some other number along with it so always with the partner having care and concern always having somebody to uh, around okay then irrational number heart rules the mind okay irrational decisions and the other imaginary numbers are about uh, fantasy and um, um bringing another word here passionate okay so these these second parts are the uh, wherever we have multiple words the last and second last would be the ones we need to use to map it to um in this case uh, zodiac sign okay lagna creative multifaceted because having imaginary or as well as real both parts together then transcendental number is like going beyond 
and the key here is others over the self now if you can make a guess what would be the lagna signs first one bold fighter aries 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 yes okay. things negative Does anyone remember which sign has things negative it is scorpio 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 then here the key was care and concern cancer cancer in this case cancer is more about nurturing yes care is there but general concern for everyone virgo pisces pisces no it it's virgo hospitality yeah heart rules the mind pisces not really pisces here is that uh, cancer is what i have mapped it to because having um, no enemies friendly to everybody no enemies like that so always having that emotional element this should be easier. rahu rahu no no we are discussing signs libra libra lagna sign libra pisces libra 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 yes libra is passionate charismatic personality that kind of thing multifaceted leo creative also creative multifaceted is leo this one others over self pisces this pisces yes this is clearly pisces okay so thank you for participating this was nice now coming to